Yes. Found the route the Morningstar uses to deliver their goods buried in the Syndicate files. You saying we drop a few pipe bombs under them? Fuck that. I'm saying we use a tank. This may be the best idea you've ever had. I wish I had a picture of this. Star? I thought we already were. Oh, not like this. You've been personally selected for a spot on a game show here in town. Game show? You're not trying to auction me off on some dating thing, are you? Trust me, you'll love this shit. Meet me and I'll show you. <sighs> you better be right. Steelport, and welcome to Professor Genki's Super Ethical Reality Climax. Time to see how the game is played. Fight your way through Professor Genki's Super Sparkle Lab for fun and profit. Now, with every man, woman, and tiger shot, your prize money goes up. But look out. No one likes it when you shoot a panel. On it unethical. Once you've collected enough money, the door to the lab opens up, and you're free to go. But if you think it's that easy, you've never seen Kinky before. Oh, and one more thing. On this show, no one gets to take a break. If you want to stay in the fight, be sure to shoot the first aid target. Good luck. It's murder time. Fun time. Welcome to Professor Genki's Super Ethical Reality Climax. Murder Just time is fun time, <laughs> right, Bobby? You got it, Zach. If our contestants can survive the deadly traps, armed mascots, and those freakishly huge hunters, they can win a hefty pile of cash. This game looks deadly, because it is. <laughs> but it's still probably safer than driving in Steelport. <laughs> 
Our competitor isn't from Steelport this time, Zach. Today, we'll be watching the leader of the Saints, the world-famous Stillwater Street Gang. As many times as this former gangbanger has been shot at, blown up, run over, and generally put through hell, this competition probably seems pretty routine. Uh, routine, maybe, but lucrative. You are going to make Professor Genki-sized dollars driving hoes around, that's for sure. <laughs> Cha-ching! Apparently, our contestant is quite the hero back in Stillwater. Have you ever been to Stillwater, Bobby? I did, and it wasn't a good trip. My car got covered in sewage by a passing septic truck. <laughs> really? What did you do to piss off the driver? I didn't do a damn thing. I just wish I hadn't rented a convertible. Wait, you were in the car when this happened? Back to the action. Our contestant is doing really well. There will be penalties for that mistake. veteran gunslingers in this arena. So, Bobby, how do you clean sewage out of a convertible? With a toothbrush. Really? No, I let the rental company take care of it. Are you kidding me? Oh, wasn't that kind of shitty of you? Not as shitty as what this contestant is doing to those mascots. This is quickly becoming a performance for the record books. I'm surprised the syndicate is still standing after all this shit we've thrown at him. I don't see a reason to stop. Not saying we should. All right. They see you at the broken shillelagh. This doesn't seem like your kind of place, Pierce. What's the hate? The beer is cheap, and I'm the best looking motherfucker in here. Look, you may think it's time to kick back, but I'm done toying with these bastards. I want Loren, and I want him now. So where is he? No idea. But 10K says he's hiding out in that big ass skyscraper. Nah, Loren's a tactician. He's not gonna hole up in a building that screams, I'm a criminal mastermind. I need something concrete. To hit up powder. No, I don't have time for a stripper. No, Powder's a designer gun store downtown. I saw some of Loren's thugs talking to the owner. There's got to be something there. All right, let's go shopping. Shandy, give me good news. We're gonna burn powder to the ground. That's a little extreme. See you there. Shandy, wait. Oh boy.
Yeah, a lot of people with guns in there. We'll go in the back way. You don't think the back's guarded? There's like two punks. What about the inside, motherfucker? Put in your tampons and let's do this. Shondi. You said two guys, not my fault. No, I'm serious. This is my kind of plan. Good to be the king. Let's get inside. in charge here probably knows where to find Loren. Let's head to the office and see if they're hiding under their desk. Can't be good. Mini gun.
Okay, that was impressive. Giving him a choice. Too easy. Guess the manager cleared out. I'll get what I can off the computer. How good a shot are you? Pierce, we've waited long enough. Now we go for Loren. It won't be easy. That whole tower's got to be crawling with Morningstar. Since when have we done things the easy way? True. So what's the plan? Kill everyone we see and find Loren? Makes sense. Meet me at the penthouse. I'll call Shandi. Shandi, it's time. Just tell me where to be. We're meeting at the penthouse. I am gonna kill that son of a bitch. Don't worry. He won't get away this time. You bet your ass he won't. Uh, it's a little big for you. Give me the goddamn gun, Pierce. Okay. All right, let's give that motherfucker what's coming to him. You sure you want to do this, Shandi? Don't worry about me. I need this. Loren has to pay for what he did, and I want to be there when he gets what he deserves. No worries, girl. 
We're not stopping with Loren. We're taking out his whole fucking syndicate. I think we'll need to do a little more than kill one guy to do that. We didn't steal that bomb for nothing. How hard do you think finding Philippe will be? Come on, he's a criminal mastermind. He's gotta be on the top floor. It's like a rule. You think he's gonna be that cliche? Doesn't matter. We're killing everyone in there. You sure the crew has the right address for our delivery? Oh, it's all taken care of. As soon as we make sure the loading dock is clear, they'll drive it in. How many times you gonna check that gun? How long is it gonna take us to get there? I was just asking. Save it for Lorenz goons. They ain't fucking around here. Shit, they have snipers in here. You think all packages are this hard to drop off here? Ha ha, can you just shoot them? Ooh, it's the blood pumping. To my loins, oh! Here's our delivery now. <laughs> Bomb set and the clock's ticking. Why didn't we wait to do that until after we killed Loren? That's a really good question. We should move.
with all those big guys you keep seeing? Clones? Makes sense to me. What? Uh, okay, maybe makes sense was too strong. What should we call these guys? Who cares? They're blowing up with the rest of this place. How about bricks? They hit like they're made of this stuff. Bricks? Really? All right. What would you call them? John! You ain't getting how this works, are you? <laughs> Love to win. What the hell is all this? Philip likes his things custom made. And for his brutes, I am the master pattern, you see. Why are you still strung up if they already cloned your ass? The copies are flawed. They have my brawn, but not my brain. I can help you. The last time a big naked dude said he could help me, it did not end well. What could he do anyway? Those wires and shit are probably keeping him alive. Trust me, I'm still strong enough to kill Philippe. You want some clothes, man? No time. Man. Like I said, last time a big naked dude. This elevator will take us to the offices. Follow me to Philip's office. Seriously, man, you know, if you want, I can find you like a curtain or something for you, you know? The human body is nothing to be ashamed of, unless you have insecurities i'm good hey man you got a name my name is Oli kirloff so what did you do before you were a glorified pincushion i think it's best for our friendship i never elaborate just know that the enemy of your enemy is your friend as long as you oppose the syndicate you have nothing to fear from me works for me welcome to the saints Lorenz's office is this way. Damn it! That's an express elevator to the basement. There's no way to catch him. Fuck that. 
that. Knock this thing loose! I'm gonna crush that son of a bitch. Leave it to me. I've got this one! Hurry it up! He's getting away! Under too much fire! Set up here! <laughs> Damn it! Should have thought of a Belgian pancake joke. Time to blow this place to hell. I hate this place more than anyone, but it would be folly to destroy Philip's research without seeing what we can harvest from it. We came here to send a message, didn't we? Why not keep the building for yourself? Your choice here, boss. We're gonna have to do something about the pink. You'd prefer a more manly shade, like purple?